Hi, I'm Valerie. Welcome back to the Motopress YouTube channel. This video is dedicated to the newest update of our appointment booking plugin. So today I'd like to take you through a brief overview of its new feature. With version 1.6 or greater, the plugin allows clients to pay appointments directly with PayPal. After watching this video, you'll be able to add PayPal on your website and collect online payments not only with Stripe, wire transfer or pay on arrival methods, but also via PayPal. Without any further delay, let's get started. PayPal is one of the most used payment methods on the Internet. There are two easy ways to test your PayPal payment form. It's either by making an actual payment or through PayPal sandbox mode. Anyway, if you want to integrate PayPal for appointments, make sure you've created your PayPal business account first. To start configuring PayPal with the appointment booking plugin, you should go to Appointments, Settings, Find Payments. As you see, PayPal is added to the list of payment gateways available. Now manage. First, you need to enable the PayPal method by checking the box. And then you can choose if you would like to use PayPal in sandbox mode or in live mode. Title is the text displayed at checkout and you can change the default pay by PayPal message. The description field is optional. A little disclaimer, for this tutorial I'm going to use the Sandbox mode and the test account credentials. PayPal Sandbox mode is a testing environment that actually mimics the live PayPal production environment and is used only for testing purposes. By testing the process you can see the steps your visitors will take while also ensuring that the payment process is functioning as it should. That's what we need right now to complete a payment and examine the whole process safely, including email notifications and monitoring payments via the Payments menu. To set your PayPal sandbox settings, simply follow the next steps. Click the link in the dashboard to get the credentials to test PayPal as a sandbox. After clicking, you'll find yourself on the PayPal developer site. As you may notice, I've already logged in. To log in, use your PayPal account credentials. On the left in the dashboard menu, click on My Apps and Credentials. Make sure you're on the Sandbox tab to get the API credentials you'll use while you're testing. In the REST API app section, you need to use the existing app or create a new one. Once your app is ready, click View Details. You must then copy data from the fields Client ID and Secret and put this info into the respective fields in your WordPress dashboard. Don't forget to save changes. Now the new payment method should appear at checkout when clients want to book an appointment with you. For this, a client will select PayPal or the option with credit or debit card. To continue with PayPal, they must log in to their personal account. Where are we going to find the credentials for this account? In the left-hand navigation, look under the Sandbox section and click Accounts. There you'll find all the necessary details. PayPal will have already created two test accounts for you, one for a business account and one for a personal account. To book an appointment, we use a personal test account. Click on the three dots under Manage Accounts and go for View slash Edit Account. In the pop-up window that appears, you'll see the details for the personal test profile that was automatically created for you. Fill out the form with the personal test email and password listed under the Profile tab. To avoid entering login details again, check the Stay logged in to pay faster option. Then click the Login button. Once you're logged in, 
you'll be taken to the order summary page. Here, check that the total matches what was listed in your form. Then click the Pay Now button. Wait a little. You'll then see a confirmation message in your booking wizard. Here we go. The reservation is completed. Alternatively, customers who don't have a PayPal account can go for the credit or debit card payments. PayPal will fetch its usual form. Again, all the information for filling in the form, such as a card number and its expiration date, can be found by viewing personal account details under the Funding tab. Cool! We booked and paid one more service. Two emails will be sent, a notification email to your admin email address and a confirmation email to the customer that completed the payment. You'll be able to check the booking details from the WordPress administrator area. All paid bookings appear with the status confirmed. The payments menu for its part will keep track of all your clients' online transactions. Finally, you'll want to check that the completed order appears in your personal test account in PayPal. To do this, return to your Sandbox test accounts page on PayPal's developer site. Next, click on the three dots under Manage Accounts for the personal test email. Then, select View Notifications. This will open a list of any recent actions taken under this account. This list will include the receipt from your test transaction. You can click on the email address for the receipt to open more details and check that they match your test order. To inspect test payments you received in your business account or test refunds, Go to sandbox.paypal.com and log in using the credentials of the test business account. On the Overview tab under Activity, you'll see the payment listed uh, that you received following the test booking. For instance, by clicking on Refund, you'll open the page where you can issue a full or partial refund for 180 days after the original payment was sent. That's it! Now you know how to test PayPal payments. Once you've completed your integration, done your testing, be ready to go live with your application. To use the live mode and obtain live credentials, toggle to the live tab. You'll just need to copy live client ID and live secret from your PayPal business account and paste them into appointment booking settings. So it's pretty much the same thing that we've done today, only with the live mode. We hope that PayPal payments method will bring more flexibility, productivity and of course more bookings with your website powered by our WordPress appointment booking plugin. This is the main news for today. Stay tuned for more updates this year and let us know if you have any questions so far. As usual, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you're new here, welcome. And consider subscribing and clicking the notification bell so we get to see each other more often. Thank you for watching. I'm going to see you in the next video.